Hey guys, what's up? It's Kinsey. Welcome back to my channel. I just filmed another video in this exact top in the same location. We're just gonna ignore it. Um, oh my gosh, we're having a good day. Today, we're gonna be doing an entire hair care routine video. So from when I go to the salon, to when I go home, when I take care of it at home, when I style it. You get the idea. If you guys like this video, be sure to subscribe, follow me on Instagram, give this video a thumbs up if you guys wanna see more videos like it, and let's get started. So, going to the salon, um, I'm going to take you guys with me to the salon that I go to in LA. It is basically it's just my hairstylist, Angela Knox, my favorite person. She's so freaking cute and nice, and I just love her. She's also amazing at hair. I love, she has dyed my hair darker multiple times, and I just am like obsessed with it every single time. So she's the best, so I'm going to be taking you guys with me and show you guys what we do there. <laughs> She's awesome, and then she also works with Carlos, who does my hair in Dallas. That is when I got extensions and did all of that. I love the extensions. I just have to wait until I go back to Texas to do all that, basically. I had to take them out, like, last Monday and go to Greece. Long story. But anyways, looked amazing. Um, I just had long extensions in. I vlogged that as well, so I'll have that vlog linked down below. But if you guys are in Dallas and looking for people to do your hair, I'll have to do Instagram linked down below. And hers, too. You guys should check them out. Tell them I sent you. I'm a big fan. They're super fun. And I'm Carlos, and we're Global Group Hairdressing. Dallas subscribers, come check us out, Dallas Design District. And check out my Instagram at carlosrojas911. See you guys later. So anyways, that is what I do when I get my hair done. Basically, again, all I ask for is, I normally ask for it to get thinned out because my hair just gets really thick, um, texturized in so it's not too blunt, and like longer layers. It's pretty much it. I kind of always just go at it and I'm like, oh, whatever. But those are just the things that I like set on. Okay, how I take care of it. 
I get asked a lot like what shampoo and conditioner I use, blah blah blah. Whatever is in my shower, like I don't have anything special. The one product I will say that I have not been using lately, but that has made a huge difference in my hair in the past. The it's a tin leave-in conditioner with keratin. That stuff is amazing. It's not over high, it's actually that good. And if you get it at Nordstrom Wrap, I talk about this in a video where I where I use the exact same thing. So if you're feeling deja vu, that's why. Uh, if you get a Nordstrom Rack or like TJ Maxx or something, you can get it like way discounted because it is kind of pricier for a drugstore product. That stuff's amazing. I love it. I always use a wet brush. I never brush out my hair with like a normal brush, always a wet brush. Um, and then what else? That's pretty much it. I don't really do anything special. Okay, and then how I style it. So I'm going to be showing you guys how I style it two ways. Um, I've already shown you guys multiple times my channel how I do it with the big curls. I'll have a video linked down below where I show you guys that like all in depth. Um, that's kind of like my probably most go-to hairstyle. And I'm also going to show you guys how I do these waves. More of like a beachy, loose, kind of texturized like curl, if that makes any sense. So, uh, let's get into that. Alright, so I am about to curl my hair. I decided I wanted to kind of just style this real time. Not do like a tutorial because I'm not like great at hair anyways. So this is without extensions. Obviously, really the only thing for the extensions that I had that changed was just that there was more hair. There was really nothing else that changed. Okay, the curling iron, should probably turn this on, that I am using is the Dry Bar 3-Day Bender. I believe this is the one inch and then the other curling iron that I use is just the Conair I have tutorials and so many get ready with me's and stuff where I show you guys that but I'll have that link down below as well Those are just really big loose curls. Honestly, I probably do those a little bit more than I do these I really do like this dry bar uh, three-day bender, but obviously like there's always dupes This is a little bit pricier for a curling iron. My Conair one that I've used forever is literally like $15 on Amazon. I will have it linked down below. That one is so amazing, but if you are fine with paying more and you really want the three-day bender, I highly recommend it. The first thing I do is I just section off my hair. So I will just like throw the top half in a bun. My sister does hair in Dallas. You guys should hit her up. I'll have her Instagram down below. She did my hair like this. She went to our Chicago store stop and then did my hair one night and it looked amazing so that's why I bought this and I just FaceTimed her and I was like please tell me what you did because I still haven't gotten it to look as good as she got it to look which would make sense because she like got one scope here but whatever okay so with the bottom pieces I'm just going to take one piece of hair the first two I'm gonna curl away from the face and then after that I'm just gonna alternate so then one will go towards the face and then one will go away from the face this gives more like a beachy texturized loose waves kind of feel oh yeah and she said <laughs> my sister said to leave like the last two inches out of the curling iron that's like really what gives it more of like a beachy feel yeah okay so you have a curl like this and then the end as you guys can see is straight I'm gonna do one more away from the face and then after that I'll alternate okay and then from here I'm gonna alternate next curl will be towards my face again just making sure that I'm leaving like a piece like a straight piece at the end this cut is fresh. Okay, so here you guys can see that this is just a little bit messier and a little bit more of a beach wave. I'm going to tuck this behind and then I'm going to let the rest of my hair loose. So this is the part that I don't really know about. My sister said that for the volume, you want to kind of like straighten this. Like, the, like you want to straighten it forward and she said with the three day bender you can do that and straighten it forward and then you're going to curl it away from your face um, same thing I curled it the wrong way but this is the idea uh, I, this is this is more it but whatever well, I'll figure it out as time goes okay this is going to be the next piece you also want curled away from your face so I'm going to go ahead and do that okay this can be curled Towards the face, this is where I'm gonna start alternating. Okay, so the next step is texturizing spray. My favorite is from this brand, Amika, I think. It's the Undone Texture Spray. I really like this stuff, it gives you really good volume. From here, you're just gonna to wanna to blow dry a little bit, like just all throughout your hair or your head. So 
to give it some good volume. And then the last step is just a hairspray. So I'm gonna be using the It's a Tan Miracle Super Hold Finishing Hairspray. I'm a huge fan of this hairstyle. Completely owe everything to my sister. She did this to me and I was like, wait, and then I bought everything that she used. So this is just like my easy, um, like beachy waves hairstyle. It literally takes me like seven minutes to do this when I'm not filming. It's super easy, super simple, and it holds really good. This is like my favorite like second day hairstyle. Like when, tomorrow my hair will look even better, you know? So I love this one. Alright, so that is it for my hair care routine, going to the salon, showing you guys what I do at home, showing you guys how I style my hair. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see more like it, let me know by giving this video a thumbs up and subscribe. I love you guys so much. Um, if you haven't followed my Instagram yet, be sure to. Love you guys so much, and I'll see you soon. Bye! Where the hell are my friends? Home alone, not again. Friday, wide in the internet. Only love